leader. That's where I start to be. Be proactive. I'll take care of it. I got it. And you didn't even have to ask me. A leader puts first things first. Sure, I'd like to stay outside and play, but I've got homework to finish. So volleyball, hopscotch, jump rope, riding my bike and scooter, it'll just have to wait. It takes a strong person to be a leader. Not in the body, but strong in the mind. Because once things turn sour, there is no undo button. You can't press your ride. A leader has to make the smart decision the first time. It only takes a second to get in trouble, but a lifetime to repair. So I'll try to be that leader that will help you see clear. Matter of fact, right now, I'll be clear. I'm a leader. I don't think it. I know it. Realize, a leader doesn't have to be a Dr. King, Rosa Parks, the president, or the pope. A leader can be a principal, janitor, bus driver, a student, or just someone who gives others hope. Some leaders stand in front with their following behind. I choose to stand hand in hand with other leaders side by side. And together we say, stop the bullying, stop the teasing, stop the fighting. There are peaceful ways problems can be handled. Other than posting violent and hurtful messages on Instagram, Facebook, and the YouTube channel. We can talk about our problems. You see, one day I plan to lead a nation. But for the time being, I'll start with just little old me right here at Plantation.